Hello everyone, this is Ari from Iris Communication. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can install or set up your Linksys range extender or repeater. This will extend your Wi-Fi. In my previous video, I show how you can do by CD. In this video, I will show you how you can do by manually. For manually set up this Linksys Cisco extender, what you have to do, you have to put first with electric cable and you will see the green light is on. After that, you have to use the LAN cable and connect the LAN cable into the extender. After that, the other part you have to connect with the desktop PC or the laptop PC. As you see, I'm connecting now. Okay, that is done. As you see, I have Windows 8. For the settings as Windows 8, Windows 7 should be the same. What I need to do? Okay, when you connect, normally it should pop up this screen automatically. As you see, my Internet Explorer is at the default browser. is open automatically and it will ask me put some username and password. If it's not pop up automatically, you have to click Internet Explorer or which browser is your default browser. So you have to remember which one is your default browser. Open that one and you will see this screen normally. Okay. In some case, if you not see this skin normally, as you see my computer at the down my network, here you should see and when you click that one and you will see this. What I have to do now, I will put a username and password. I will put a username as ADMIN admin and passwords the same ADMIN admin and I will click OK and it will bring me to this menu as you see. Here you can select your language. The second option automatic don't do nothing if you want you can change the name of your device it's RE2000 you can put any name as you want after here you see wireless click this one and here should appear Wi-Fi that level here that is the name of the SSID of the Wi-Fi you will see here the list which Wi-Fi you want to extend you have to click that one and you have to put connect as I want to extend this Wi-Fi so I have to click this one after that I have to connect click connect and I have to put the password of that specific Wi-Fi address I want to extend so the password I have to put and I will be back after putting the password I will click connect and as you see the process is begin okay Okay, the process is done and how we'll know this process is done at the corner as you see my internet is start working. I can click for browser because now I'm not connected with the Wi-Fi. I'm connected via this machine to the internet. Should work as you see. One more thing as you see status. After in a status as you see Ethernal or WLAN statistics you have to click. And here as you see Fibertel Wi-Fi is connected now and the signal is 100 on 100 so this is connected fine and properly if you like this video please do subscribe if you have any question leave me as a comment i will try to answer you as much fast as possible as always for more information go to the irs communication www.irscommunication.com good night ciao